Oh, welcome back. So today we're going to try and catch some freshwater crayfish. Got a nice creek behind us here, so we're just going to go and spread a few lines along it and uh, yeah, see if we can't catch a few. Still early in the season, um, but hopefully they're, they're out and about. So we'll uh, yeah, see how we go. Hopefully we can catch a few to show you, get a bit of a feed. Pretty little section of the river to be on, so even if we don't catch one, it's just nice being out and about. Beautiful. Still bloody cold. There'll be no swimming today. No swimming at all. So, see if we can get some crayfish. Let's go. <sighs> Got one? Oh yeah, that's tight, isn't it? Well, that's been in for, what, 10, 15? Ditch the thong so I don't slip on the ass. Right, last time the one that came out of here was quite a good size, so we'll see if we can get this one. Get them. Can they pull in? Actually, unhook it. Unhook it off there if you can. I can't see it. There's its antenna. It's one on Oh, wow. Whole, oh. Scooping. No way. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Look at that! Hole. Oh. He's got to be close to two. He's got to be close to the. That's bigger than the last one. Do we have scales? Oh, we don't have scales. Oh, it's got eggs. Me. It has to have eggs. Eggs? Nah. Well, that'd be a shake. well, you can tell by the back. No, it's a male. Have a look at the size of that. That's. Hang oh, on. he's got a good hold of me. <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> 15 minutes. Holy. Be... What have the other ones got? I don't know. That'd have to be 600 or grams. What's on that other one? It's a 600. That's more than 600 grams. There we are. Look at that. Something just grabbed that. All right. All right. I'll paint this one up. Put it in I'll the scoop the other net. <laughs> Holy. Put on barracuda. Oh, Dad, look what it did to the bait. Yeah, that was a full, nearly a full barracuda. 15 minutes and that came out. Not bad at all. I got another one just here. It's got a, it's got a decent size on it. Let's just come up here, show, show the other two. Oh, your dad, the other one's a good size as well. The other one's a good size as well? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to skip the other one. Oh, I'm catching these things. Let's go, see if Tom can get this one. Get this one in. We've paid the farmer for coming here, which was uh, two crays. And hopefully we can get a, a good bag full. The river's obviously full of them. Jeez, he did a number on that bait. Look at that, that's trashed. All right. Yeah, we'll get this back in. Oh, yeah. Alright. You're gonna try and get this one? Mm -hmm. Right, so you just gotta get in behind it. Well that's all right, I'll let you get settled on the bank. Go close to the water. So you can get in behind him there. Oh yeah, he's a good size too. Venison on this line. All right, tell me when you reckon you can get in behind him. Go slowly in behind him there. Down, go, scoop. Got him. 
Look at that. Holy. <laughs> That's a little bit smaller, but similar size. All right, put it down. I'll get it. Oh, that bit of venison on that one. I'll get that back in. I thought we can get another one. Look at him. Go grab it. Check if it's got eggs. Oh. You're right. Can you grab his claws like you can? <laughs> eggs. No eggs nope. again. Oh, look at it. It's nearly going to get me. Yeah, hold the camera. Yeah, it got me. Uh, Tiny freshwater crays. Well and truly size. We'll measure him again, Stu. Beautiful. And that's the first two of, what, ten lines? Yep. Alright, let's go. See if we can get some more. Yeah, Dad. Alright, second spot. I'm excited about this one because this is where we caught the one that was nearly a kilo, or just over a kilo last year. Can't quite remember its size. So we'll see how we go. Line's tight, so looks like we've got one on there. Both lines, no, just one line tight. Alright, it's real tight too. Yeah, you, yeah, we'll see see how big it is. Oh, I can think I can see it out there actually. This one. Right, kick them off. Looks to be a fair size. There it is out there. Oh yeah. He's big. He looks big. Do you want to know? Oh. That mum said she could. Yes. Go behind it. Oh, it gripped off the gripped off the net. <laughs> oh wow. Oh, another one similar size. Once the grip came off the net. That's not ideal. Oh no, this is bigger. <laughs> when you grab it. Eggs? I don't know, yeah. That was a full barracuda. That was a full barracuda. It's so spiky, I can't get out of the net. This back in. These are bigger than last time the flies. Got eggs. That's it. Yep. I think. Oh, that leeches. Come on. Does it have like little berries on the tail dust? <laughs> leeches. Yeah, leeches. I don't know. No eggs again. Eggs are red. Look at the size of that one. That's awesome. That's three, three good crays from three lines. That one there, unfortunately got none, which would make it not four from four. It's all right. No, no, it's got nothing on it. This one does not. Nothing on that one as yet. We'll just leave it there. <coughs> all right, you reckon you're going to be able to net that one, Tom? So this one here, we were having a go at catching in the dark last night, but weren't having a hell of a lot of luck. Let's see if Tommy can catch it. Uh, I think so. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I can see it. Keep going. Just stop for a sec. Keep pulling. I think so. Slow, very slow. It's not as big as the other ones. Just gentle. No, 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 it's not. It's there. All right, can you see your bait? Yep. Right, reach in and go over the back of that. Tom trying to do this one all solo. Hard down. Got it? No, don't, don't try again. So you weren't hard down, mate, when you started scooping forward. That's all right, put it in. Oh, did I miss it? Yeah. Nippers, they were tiny. No, he, was, he wasn't too bad. Are you sure? Yeah. That's alright, he should be back. 
Good time of year for snakes too. Which we haven't seen just yet. How's that looking? Yeah, yeah there's one on that. You got the net? What? Oh, you've got the whole bait. Yeah, it's There's the bait. See it. Alright, give me the give me the net quick. Where's the bait? Get it in there. No. There. How did he take that? I don't know. That's a fresh barracuda. Yeah, barracuda. Well it works. Oh! <laughs> Look at that! Oh! That's just sheer dumb luck. He was in the wrong spot at the wrong time when I put that net down. <laughs> that. Right. Look at that, that's awesome. He pinched our bait. And I just went in after him. Look at this. A lot smaller than the. The other ones. No, no eggs. eggs. Heaps to measure more. him. No, he's size. Ow, ow. So, tie that on again. Yeah. Oh wait, no, I wasn't that good. Ow. Ow. No eggs again. He was just in the wrong spot at the wrong time when I put that net down. So that. That's our fourth. I reckon so that's into a, last night. Turned into a pretty good day. Uh, it's only 11 o'clock, so we'll keep going. We've got them all back in. Hopefully we can get another few. Um, all right, back again. Second look here. This is where we caught a good one before. Still the one line's not tight. Oh, I don't think either of them are tight. Oh, yeah, no, there's one on that. I can see it. Can you see it there? Yep. All right, squat down. Yeah, I'll pull this in. It's very, very heavy on the line. Oh. Okay. He's coming. Yeah, got him. Got him? Yeah, yeah, keep just, just wait. Oh yeah, he's good, isn't he? Yeah. Oh yeah, make sure you're in behind him and down. He's a good one. He's big. Ready? Keep no, no, wait for him. There's not much bait left on that. Right, you reckon you can get him behind him? Go, go. Down, got him. Oh. Oh. Flipping. He's in. He's not getting out. <laughs> Have a look. That is That's massive. a stonker. Grab my head. That's huge. Oh, I've got blackberries up my ass. Wow. That. That's, that's just ridiculous. <laughs> Look at it! Just saltwater ones that size. No eggs. No eggs? That's oversized, I reckon. <laughs> no eggs. Oh. Look at it! Look at the claws on it. Have a look at that. That. Camera. Up. That is amazing. That's huge. That's probably. The biggest cry I've caught. Same. <laughs> that is absolutely immense. He dropped off as we were pulling him in, but then he came for the bait again, which is awesome. Um, no bait left, so leave I that reckon. one out because they might come for this one. Yeah. Do we move that one here? Uh, what we'll do with this one? This is nice. Oh, I nearly ended up on just in the water with the crayfish. I wouldn't have let it go. Oh. 
I wouldn't have let it go, that's for sure. I would have grabbed the crayfish have, first. Have a look at it. There's that's a good it. feed on that one. I would love to weigh that. Let's see how much that weighs. That, these are one of my favourite things to catch, these crows. They're absolutely amazing creature. And look at that. That's awesome. not the small crustacean. No. Very, very good. We'll see how we go on the next line. Alright, see where we got here. with the, was two here within 10 minutes last time. No boat on one. There we go. This is why we were going to bring the boat. What about that other one? Uh, Tight, yep. Yeah, I can see it too. So... So we didn't bring any bait, which was a bit of a bit of a mistake, because that's gone, the bait on there. This one's you gonna try netting this one again? Uh, you want so there he is, no no, you get him. There he is there. I'll try to bring him round because there's a little stick in the water there. Oh he's good. Gonna be able to get him behind him there. Be further. Right, I'd go for that there. Go down. Yep. Nice. <laughs> Another big one. Bring. All right. That venison. The venison tough. stays heaps better. All right, put that back there. See if there's another one there. Just leave him in the net, mate. Oh, hang on. Just check for berries. Nothing. No berries. Look, that's about as big as a yabby nipper <laughs> on its yeah. foot. Oh yeah, another, another good size. Wash him off. I don't really want to put him in the water because he'll flick and cut me to bits. So there he is, another big one. Absolute stonker of a thing. We've probably got enough for us to to eat today, so go back to camp, cook a couple of these up. They're beautiful eating. And yeah, still got four lines in that we got to check. We'll check those a bit later. But uh, yeah, very good day. We might just start letting a few go now because we've got a good feed of them. Let's go. All right, couple, of, couple more lines down here. Uh, haven't had a look at these ones today. They've been in for a while, so hopefully the bait's still on them and Craig's hanging on the end. Um, yeah, probably pretty well catch and release at this point because we've got heaps of them. But still, just for fun, we're going to pull them in and um, yeah, have a have a quick look at them and let them go. Yep, my bad. No bait and crayfish. Oh yeah, he's leaving. Okay, see if you can get um, in behind him. In? I don't, I don't actually. Uh, choose... Yeah, hold this. Hold this. So he's not actually on our line. Yeah, because he got the bait. He's pinched our bait. Let's see if I can do what I did to the last one. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. At See, this point in time, it's just not really fair. They're so thick. So he's pinched our bait. He's, seen us he's coming. red. Decided enough's enough. I'm out of here. Very different colour, this one. Dude, it looks like Murray with no claw. No white claws. I reckon he's got eggs. I think I saw him. I don't know. No eggs. Very different. Oh, see if I can get that. No, let him out. go. Very different colour, this one. So we'll go over there, we'll put him on the bank so we can watch him wander back in. Yeah, obviously plenty here because we've lost our bait. That's the, the difference with venison or using red meat over fish. Fish you probably catch more, but you will lose bait. Yeah, doesn't seem to matter the size or anything. But that one there, that can go back because we've got plenty for a feed and it's, even though it is size, it's a bit little. So we'll catch it next time when it's a bit bigger.
much, guys. There it is. <laughs> you can almost need him again. <laughs> yeah, almost need him again, but we won't. All right, we'll grab these two lines. Yeah. Grab these two lines up. We've got another, got another one just down there. We'll check. Probably pull that one out too, and we'll just catch them at camp for the rest of the day. It's been been a bloody good day. If we wanted to just keep going and empty the creek of them, we could. There's plenty here. No point in doing that. We'll leave them a couple of weeks. Come back, get another feed of them. But yeah, been a fantastic day. Some good sized crays in here. I thought I thought it was here. Under that tree fern. Yeah, there it is, I think. No, it's here. Sometimes yeah. it's hard to remember where all your lines are. That one's tight. It's just whether the bait's hung on. Nice spot to get down here, though. Easy as. Oh, I don't actually think it is tight. I think it's... I think it's been tight and our bait's gone. Oh no, bait's there. Something's Just. But yeah, something's taken the most of it. Can't see it. Yeah, again, no no point just keeping on taking them. So we'll uh, we'll pull this one in and we'll head back to camp. Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's the problem with using fish. If that was a bit of venison, whatever it was would still be hanging off it. So you don't seem to get as many, but they stay around, you don't lose any either. So I like using fish because catch it while I'm at work, but uh, yeah, venison I might go back to using that because there's plenty in this creek, so you don't need uh, need the um, the attraction of the fish. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll clean up, see if we can get any more today, just for, just for fun. So just checking this line, we've only had this back in oh, three to five minutes maximum. And uh, it looks like there's something on it. And that's the venison. So a lot of the fish ones we couldn't throw back in. They'd had the bait taken. But this one here. Little one. Little one? Tiny little one. So gonna, it's only little. I'm going to just let uh, Tommy have a go at catching it himself. See if he can do everything. Nice and slow, as soon as you think you can reach him. Who says kids can't multitask, eh? Remember all hard down when you get behind it. Got him? Little one. Yeah, it is little, isn't it? Yeah. All right, so that's not size, but the exercise of catching it's still fun. Grab it. Got it. That's only just the size of a yabby, that one. Lift yeah. it up, lift it up. Turn it, turn it this yabby. way. That one actually Eggs. has a few berries. So lucky it is little. But that goes to show why there is the size limit. Even at that size, that's already breeding. And turn it, turn it, man. That's still probably... Oh, it'd be a couple of seasons away from being size. But yeah, already got a couple of eggs on there. Just those little yellow berries. So oh, return it to the water straight yeah. away. He's gonna grab it. There it is there. There it goes. Make some more for us. This creek's not short of them, but... Can we leave this one in here? Yeah. There it goes. Yeah, throw it back in. You can walk back later and get it. Yeah. We'll leave this one here too, because you can rebait that when you come back. But yeah, a oh, good little exercise, teaching him how to catch him himself. Getting quite a few crows out of here today. It's been very, very good, even though I did think it was early in the season. Obviously, the water's warmer than I thought, and they're out and about. How you going? Yeah. No, it's all not. No good on that one. Bait's probably a bit manky. That's all right, throw it back in. It's good. Alright, now that other one that has a small one on it. Yeah. Alright, well. That's it, it's been a been a good day. Caught a few. So uh, yeah, thanks thanks for watching. Um, hopefully I'll get the video up soon. 
I'm going to go back to finish building the hut that uh, you can see the other videos that uh, I've got on my channel there. Building a hut very close here, mainly for this reason, because it is such a good cray fishing spot. Um, yeah, also deer and whatnot around, just a, just a great spot to be out. So yeah, thanks for watching. Remember to hit the like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, see you in the next video.